today is indie born soprano Angela Brown. Can we brag on her for a little bit? Uh, please, go ahead, let's brag go, on Let's go ahead. Mm -hmm. Her multi genre career has been lauded on the front page of the New York Times, mm -hmm. on CNN, mm -hmm. CBS, mm -hmm. in Oprah Magazine, and Reader's Digest. Hello. With classical and pops engagements spanning six continents, Angela has graced the leading opera and symphonic stages of the world. Her vocal artistry is featured on the two time Grammy Award winning recording Ask Your Mama. Her voice is the inspiration for New York new works, including a symphonic song cycle and two principal opera roles. Mm. She is a superstar. Please help us welcome our very own superstar, Angela, Angela Brown. Brown. <laughs> hey, hey, where to get started? Hold on. I love it. You know, <laughs> gotta get it warmed up, child. Uh, you, uh, listen, uh, can uh, we? Uh, the show. The show. It's, the show. it's such an honor to have you here. You're going to actually be performing. Uh, Tosca, is that how you say Tosca. it? Tosca. Okay, Tosca. There mm -hmm. we go. For the first time in Indianapolis in November, tell us a little bit yeah. about why that's so wonderful. Well, Tosca is an opera diva like myself, and I've always seen myself and wanted to perform Tosca here in Indianapolis okay. for my Indianapolis audience with Indianapolis Opera. And it's a show that... Oh, it peels the onion of this diva Ooh. who is jealous, who is talented, beautiful, sought after by different people in the community that Ooh. want to take advantage of her and that she Ooh. can't have that happening. And so she gets to stabbing up some folks. <laughs> oh, <laughs> And it is a tour de force, and I can't wait to perform her. Wow. Mm. Okay, now in September, you will perform at the fifth annual Opera in the Park. Yes. Tell us about that experience. You're already smiling talking about it. <laughs> well, Opera in the Park, I am uh, hosting this year, and with Indianapolis uh, Opera, we always, well, it started, it started in 1997. That's mm -hmm. kind of when I got my first big shebang here yes. in the city. Mm -hmm. And now it's, it's in its third season, or fifth season, I think okay. you yeah. said. Mm -hmm. um, and we're going to have so many different genres of music um, to be presented on this program. Uh, Joshua Thompson and Jared Thompson mm -hmm. uh, are going to be part of it. And we uh, love. of course, oh, by the way, oh, they've yeah. been in one of our, two of our all Indian yes, artists see, before. See. And the opera course of Indianapolis Opera and, uh, and then I'll do a little singing, a little Toscarin, and I'll have a, a, a partner with me, and we'll do a little Shana from Tosca. So it's going to be fun. And, yeah. you know, we want to make sure that you scan that QR code that you see on the screen right there, because right there. you can get the tickets to all those great performances. Right. Now, listen, you've been awarded the Lifetime Achievement Award by the Coalition for African Americans in Performing Arts. And if she's not busy enough, you even had your own businesses. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> Tell us about it. I have to diversify. Hello, come uh, diversify. <laughs> I, I have a foundation called Morning Brown that brings culture to cultural deserts. I didn't know that Chicago mm -hmm. has a cultural desert because mm -hmm. there are circumstances where people in the community can't come mm -hmm. to programming because of it being cost prohibitive. Yeah. Mm. So Morning Brown brings that to those cultural deserts. And I have a show called Opera from a Sister's Point of View. <laughs> okay, you gotta like lean back on it. Yes. And it's a show that demystifies opera for audiences that normally wouldn't go. Mm. And uh, normally I did that show in conjunction with, you know, being in opera and singing across mm -hmm. the, the country and I would be part of their educational program. But uh, with Morning Brown, I'm able to accept donations nations. Oh. Yes, honey. <laughs> Check it out. Morningbrown.org. All of that will be at the bottom of your screen, too. Okay. And so excited about That's that. That's amazing. And then yeah. I have my vocal studio here in the city, uh, Angela Brown Vocal Studio, that is at 4011 North Pennsylvania in the same building mm -hmm. as the Indianapolis Opera. And you don't have to be an opera singer mm -hmm. to take voice from me. Breathing, placement, support, breath. It's all the same. You got to have it to, to breathe, to speak, to sing, and then I will help you figure out what genre of music will be best for you. So come Ooh. one, come all. Oh, all well, I know is I want her yeah, genre right now. I, I, yes. I want to hear your genre mm -hmm. right now. Is mm -hmm. it okay if, if you grace us with your song? Yes. All right. I would like to sing the aria Desiderate from the opera Tosca. Well, with that, Miss Angela Brown, the stage is yours. Thank you so much.
Yeah.